Hello folks, this is uh, uh, again 2019, February, March, paper 1, 2, and the question number is 7. It says that a stone is thrown vertically upward from a point that is 12 meter above the sea. It then falls into the sea below after 3.5 seconds. So the overall uh, motion will be somewhat like this. So we have some sort of a point here or a cliff. So from here, stone is thrown upward and then it comes back and and uh, uh, falls into the sea after 3.4 uh, second so this height is equal to 12 meters 12 meters so uh, we have to find uh, at which speed was the stone released when it was thrown so here we have to find the uh, firing velocity or firing speed so now uh, the actual equation for uh, finding the height is equal to h equal to ut plus uh, 1 by 2 gt square and this equation is applicable applicable if if we have a body a body just uh, dropping from here to here dropping from here to here so in this case uh, the velocity is in velocity is in this direction g also is in this direction and the displacement also is in this direction so everything is positive but in this case what is happening here is h is downward h is downward it's okay uh, but uh, uh, what we have is um, the velocity is in the initial velocity is u is in reverse direction so h downward u in reverse direction so 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 what now we need to do here is we have to manipulate this equation slightly so what you can do here is for this case so if i take uh, u as positive u as positive u as positive then h should be negative and uh, the ascent due to gravity should also be negative because it's uh, acting downward so h downward uh, g downward u upward so i can do minus h equal to equal to ut minus 1 by 2 gt square so minus h equal to ut minus 1 by 2 gt square i can or reversely what i can do is h equal to minus ut plus 1 by 2 gt square so anything works so g downward s downward and u uh, upward so anything works so let's say uh, i use this equation here I use this equation so s is equal to uh, 12 12 equal to uh, minus u into 3.4 uh, plus 1 by 2 into g is uh, 9.81 into 3.4 squared so if i uh, use the equations uh, and reverse here so this when i solve this when i solve this uh, what i get is so what i can do here is um, yeah so 12 uh, minus uh, bracket 0 0.5 into 9.81 into 3.4 square um, equal to um, divided 3.4 3.4 so this uh, gives us this gives us uh 13.13.13 meter per second per second which is equal to the value of u so when nearest value is taken it becomes equal to 13 meter per second which is in choice number c so c should be the correct choice here